A typical morning whenever I come in is, um, well the first thing that I do is kind of check the, the oil levels and the fuel levels of all the planes that are ready to go, uh, just so we have a track and, you know, track record of, you know, which one needs to be fueled, which one needs more oil, and I also check if, you know, it has all the backup equipment that it needs, all the extra parts of oil, all the, you know, first aid kits, paper towels, funnels, stuff like that. And, uh, you know, I also, you know, wash them out uh, or, you know, wipe them down a little bit to make them look really nice. And that usually takes, a, takes an hour of, you know, my morning. These small planes I've never really had, I've never even touched uh, until now. So now that I feel a little bit more confident and uh, I'm sure I'll feel more confident later on um, around these planes, I feel like I can build a career out of it. Uh, we got years and years of experience around little airplanes. We love them. And so just to share that, with somebody that says, I want to learn something, and then, you know, the fact that he says, I can do it now. That self-esteem comes up, and like, yeah, you know, they walk a little more with pep in their step, you know, when they've accomplished something, learn how to do something. Right now, the plan is to uh, continue school. I'm so close to getting my generals, so I just need my airframe and then my power plant so I can get my full, uh, you know, license. I might stay in the general aviation field, or I might, you know, move on to commercial. I'm open to anything at this point. Uh, now that I have the, like, the familiarity and like, the experience. 